Guys, what's going on? Dean here, Function Fitness. So I'm just going to talk you through high bar, low bar. So are you a high bar or a low bar in a back squat? If you don't know what I mean by this, high bar is with the bar at the top of the traps. Okay? A low bar is lower down. Now, in this position, obviously you're not going to be able to go straight into a low bar. Because low bar, a lot, a lot of the time, especially people who are tight on the anterior area of the chest, they're not going to be able to get the hands in that position and it'll feel very uncomfortable. But the reason we sort of say why would you go into that would be, so if you're in a high bar position, just come on the side please. So if you're in a high bar position and you're squatting, this will happen where you're being pulled forward. Okay, so at the bottom of the movement, it'll pull you forward and then that's where you struggle. When you get into your like, Max reps, that's what's going to happen. However, if you were to go into a low bar position, it's a lot more of a chance of it not happening because it's not going to pull you forward. So, in that position, you can still keep that upright in the posture, driving your chest up. So, question being, are you high or low bar? If you're high bar and you're struggling to keep your chest up at the bottom of a squat and it's pulling you forward, Obviously, you're gonna injure your back eventually if you're not careful, so then take yourself down to a low bar. If you're reasonably low and you feel that it's comfortable, stick with it, but always try a high bar and a low bar to see which is the best fit for you.